Hey, what's up guys? Growing the Hobby coming back to you guys with another hockey break. One that I hope you're going to enjoy and I'm going to enjoy as well, obviously. Uh, let's fill in the background cards and we'll talk about what we're going to break today very quickly. Uh, I'm trying to bestow the power of the hockey gods with us here. Some of the greats from the past because I want a pass card out of today's break. That's what I'm looking for. Um, but yeah, anyway, let's talk uh, PSA. Let's talk 1973 tops. Guy Lafleur, PSA 7. I'll throw him up right there. As long as he don't fall over there. Uh, let's talk. A586 OPG, my PSA 8. Mario Lemieux rookie card there. Put him right there. 7980 OPG, PSA 4. Wayne Gretzky rookie card. And last but not least, just got this in the mail. Uh, very quick thing for you guys. One of the purchases I bought from a, an online store. Uh, in all honesty, I'm not even sure what store because I make so many purchases with cards. Um, apparently threw me into a raffle uh, where I guess they do this like once a month or something like that for people to bought off of them. And if you get drawn, you uh, you get a nice card. Uh, and lo and behold, because I'm like, I didn't buy this card. But no, I won it in a raffle. Honestly, I'd give them credit if I remembered the store they didn't even include. What store it was from just kind of told me I won. Uh, but from that same 1979-80 OPG, uh, it's a good one. Uh, 79-80 OPG, Gordy Howe. Look at that bad boy right there. Gordy Howe raw card in very, very good shape. Uh, from 19, like I said, 79-80 OPG. I will take that all day long. Didn't pay a dime for that. Uh, and that is a heck of a card. So we'll throw that bad boy right there. All right, that being said, guys, like I said, they're all from the past, and the reason I bring that up, we're up on a product of, you know, roughly today. we got a hobby box of 1819 Series 2, uh, but I am hunting something in the past. So, yeah, the, you can pull from 0506 Young Guns of Sidney Crosby and Alexander Ovechkin, both in here. Um, I can't remember if they're autographed or they're clear cuts or what the deal is, but... They are randomly inserted into here, and they are worth a fortune. I'm talking like 5000 plus per card. Uh, it's just insane. Uh, you know, so to pull one of those, I know it's damn near impossible, but hey, needle in a haystack, right? Odds Lakers, this is what we're looking at back here. Anybody's interested in that? Uh, the big young gun, though, in here that we're looking for. I've pulled them already, but I'll always take more. Carter Hart. He can be found here in Series 2, as well as the Elise Patterson Canvas Young Gun. Uh, so hopefully we'll pull maybe one of those two out of here and stuff. This is the info on their insert there with Synergy, National Hockey Card Day, OPG Platinum, blah, blah, blah. Put that aside. Well, let's get right the heck into these packs. I'm going to fly through the base, guys, even though this is my favorite design, I'd say, out of all the Upper, upper Deck Gear products. Beautiful card design. I love I love the card design. Um but yeah, we're gonna fly through the base. We got a canvas, Tory Krug to start us off. And we're gonna get six young guns guaranteed in here. If you pull a canvas young gun, that does not count towards your quota. You can also pull the exclusive young guns, the acetate clear cut ones, the high gloss. All of those do not count towards your six guaranteed young guns. And it looks like we've got young gun number one in this pack. Nicholas Roy. Or is it Wa? I think it's Roy. Honestly, I'm not 100% on that, but uh, that's Young Guns number one. Still looking for canvas cards out of here, the, uh, the UD Portraits cards, probably a game jersey card I would imagine in here, and then normally one hit stands above the rest, uh, you know, for each box. Yeah, OPG updates are in here as well, so it's normally found in Series 2, so Sam Steele, Marky Rookie, there you go, nothing insane with that one. I think the Elias uh, Patterson is going to be one of those rookie update cards. Uh, OPG rookie update cards are found in here as well. Holy smokes, this pack is just like not. Nah, I can't have these cards. I don't know why, because there's an OPG card in here, so it's nothing of high value, I'm sure. And it is Yuso Ricola for my pens. And actually, one of the people I saw pull this was actually on YouTube, The card, one of the cards I'm looking for. Scotty2Hockey, check out his channel. He uh, was able to pull 
one of those old school young guns uh, that were worth a fortune. Ben Bishop canvas. So if you want to see exactly what I'm looking for, check on his channel. He had uh, pulled one of these out of, I don't know if it was a, I can't remember if it was a hobby box or just a couple loose packs, but sick pull. Canvas, Jordan Eberle. And then base. So we already got four canvas cards and one young gun. These are starting to climb as everything else in, well, I was going to say in the sport, but it's not even the sports. All sports, all cards are climbing uh, through the roof. But uh, yeah, with the emergence of Carter Hart, you know, we're starting to climb up there. Dominic Turgeon, are going to be our UD rookie, uh, rookie portraits. But yeah, Carter Hart, with the way he's kind of tearing up and stuff like that, his young guns are going up, up, up in price. Uh, very close to, if not already passing, the uh, Elias Pedersen. So. Now we got a young guns in this one as well. It's going to be a base. Robert Thomas. There you go for the blues. If anything, this might help round out my young guns PC because I try to collect the young guns from the years. 1819 Series 2, I didn't open a ton of. Uh, sort of just enough to really get that Carter Hart. Jordan Cairo. So, you know, maybe I'll round out that PC a little bit with this at least. And like I said, normally, I mean, of course, watch me if you're on. But normally, one hit stands out above the rest out of the box. Got another Young Guns in here. And it is Yusuf Valamaki. So. Another Young Guns, so we're definitely picking up the speed here on the Young Guns. Nicholas uh, Abi Kubel. Yeah, Flyers fans do not, do not know that guy. I ain't gonna lie, I do not know him. Probably because of my hatred towards you guys. Yeah. Just kidding, but not really. Yeah, Penn's fan, live here in Pittsburgh and stuff. You guys know you're our arch nemesis along with the Caps. Speaking of which, Kuzi. Still like you guys, though. I don't hold anything over you. You saw Valamaki with the old portraits cards there. I think these cards are really going to stand up over time well with uh, like stickage and brickage and you know, whatever you want to term the cards sticking together. We got a silver update of Dougie Hamilton. Um, but you know, it's just a really, really nice card design in 1819. I like it a lot. Never had any problems with any of the packs or cards or anything like that, you know. Um, and if you're going to go grade them, it makes them a little bit easier because you don't really have many borders to contend with. I mean, a little bit on the young guns, but uh, centering and stuff like that's okay. Anti SOML, marquee rookie. That's a retro rookie update there. Right, moving right along. We're really already at the bottom of the box here. Less than 10 packs to go. Definitely no mega hits by any stretch of the imagination yet. Another OPG in this one, I think. Eh, it's a gold. Michael Rasmussen. Uh, interesting. I thought maybe there was numbering on that. I'm not very familiar with the golds on these updates out there. So. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I hope they don't consider that the hit of the box. Although they might. But uh, Michael Rasmussen... Gold OPG. I'm hoping that's not the hit of the box. Another Young Guns. John Gilmore this time. So we're definitely checking off the uh, the Young Guns here. What do we got here? One, two, three, four, five. Only one more guaranteed Young Guns to go. Unless, like I said, we hit a canvas one or something like that. Uh, something different, maybe? Yeah, it's a canvas of TJ Oshie. And I saw that little bit of greenage there with the trees, and I was really hoping it was like a day with a cup kind of, you know, one of those cards or something like that. But, uh, nope. Wasn't to be. This one feels a little thick. I'm thinking maybe a jersey. Yep. Definitely some thickness here. So we're going to have a jersey. Ah, you can see who it is already. Adam Gaudet. 
quite a few of his rookies I've obtained in my hunt for Elias. So there you go. All right, we're down to our final five packs. Five packs, one young gun to go. Michael Rasmussen, uh, marquee rookie again. Uh, I've had a PC of some of these guys. Were, if I didn't before, I do now. <laughs> I think it's another OPG update. And it is a retro one of Sheldon Drees. There you go. Not a big fan of OPG. I like OPG Platinum, but not really just plain old OPG, so I'm not a big fan when they throw these uh, update cards in. Here's our last Young Guns, barring, you know, hitting a different type. Hey, Czar, I'll take it. Zach Aston Reese. Very nice for the pens. That'll go to the PC. Not a high-value card, but... A cool one for the PC, so I'll take it. Final three packs. I think I see cardboard again. So probably OPG, but maybe. A, yeah, OPG. Dougie Hamilton. Yeah, nothing too crazy here. The last two cards. Or two packs. Well, for two cards, we got portraits of Noah Jolson. So, really, an uneventful break. This is our last pack, and actually, I think it's probably going to be a portraits card in here because I think we have three of those. And you're not going to have an odd number. It looks like portraits from behind. Yep, Victor Edsel. This is going to be our last card there. So, unfortunately. Nothing really big. I'm going to guess that they're counting on, pull this out, the hits of the box to kind of be this gold Michael Rasmussen from OPG, the update, and then the uh, rookie materials, Adam Gaudet. Because other than that, quite honestly, nothing really too great. I mean, our young guns, I'll review that very quick, and that's probably going to be about it. We got Czar, John Gilmore, Ab Cabell, Yusuf Alamaki, Robert Thomas is a good one, and Nicholas Roy. So, nothing insane. It is what it is, though. I took a shot. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed it nonetheless. Please do me a favor, like, subscribe, share, click that bell notification button to be notified of future videos. A lot more of them coming to you guys. As always, in the description below, you guys can find my email address, mailing address, and Instagram handle. Other than that, have a great day, great night, wherever you all are at, and we will see you next time.